Right, okay, so this is module five, but it's actually a stand-in for module five because I'm advised by our editing department that the original module five um, either wasn't recorded properly or was lost. So I'm just going to do uh, module five once again for you. It won't be quite the same because I've already done these patches, but I'm, I want to show you how to do them once again. The first thing is to make uh, take a patch that you've already waxed. This one isn't waxed, but uh, because I use all the ones that, that were, uh, but make them as aesthetic as you can by rounding them off. Okay, making them look pretty, as pretty as you can. Okay, pull all that, any bits of hairs or anything off them, bits of thread. Okay. So make them aesthetic if you can. We've already put them in tea to actually give them a bit of coloration. We might have to give them a little bit more coloration yet, but we can do that right at the end. Okay, so here's a, a wax patch. And I'll show you what we do with it. So we pretend that that's got wax on it. Okay. Right. Take your patch, put it on where it's going to go, and make marks around it just so you can remember where it's going to go. Okay, brush on to prime it some wax, some of our wax. Okay, but don't go right up to the edges of the patch, keep within two or three mil because it will all ooze out when you iron it. Okay, right, so that's primed up. Right, so put our patch on to where we've already primed. Put greaseproof paper on. And with an iron, starting from the middle, press out quite a bit of pressure on that until it's all beautifully flattened down. Then very quickly get a cold iron like this and draw the heat back out before any damage has occurred. We don't want the painting to get too hot and especially any varnish which is on it which could melt okay so we're just doing that to draw out the heat very quickly okay and then we'll remove the patch first class right when it's all gone cool and hard use a scalpel and just trim up any old wax there shouldn't be too much of it if you've done a good job with any wax that's come through any surplus, just scrape off as best you can with your scalpel, okay? Right, now if your patches are still looking a little bit bright and new, you can always, always make a wash of raw umber and white spirit, okay? And just darken them off a little bit like this. Just a very thin wash. Okay. okay. Right, we're looking at the um patches now which have been dirtied up and are looking virtually invisible. Beautiful. Right, well that's the end of module 9. Thanks for watching.